basically what I do first is I get a dirty rag and this is my way of doing it there's other ways you could do it but let's get some chain lube and make sure it says contains I don't know dries fast seem protective film that won't fling off for use for o-ring and standard chains repels dirt and water superb rust protection I like how they put superb on there and dialist formula won't stain white paint and of course my bike isn't white so uh, I do not have a center stand on this bike so you know such an easy chore as lubing a chain on a bike I has turned into a little chore uh, I have to take off the chain guard and my left rear set so as you can see I go ahead and spray a good amount of lube on there and this is how I clean the chain you have to clean the chain well I personally do I clean my chain right now I'm just doing some cosmetic cleaning keeping the chain rust free from the outside so Just let you know I'm not like some major super crazy rider. I don't have like these crazy stands for my bike. This is my daily commuter. I use this thing every day. So, you know, I could really care less how my bike looks. I just want to make sure it functions. There's a lot of gunk on the side right here. Make sure I wash that off. Again, this is just for cosmetic looks to keep the outside of the chain rust free. So, I won't have people saying, hey, your chain looks like it needs a little bit of lubing. Nah. Yeah, that, this is what that's mostly for. I'll get to the lubing, actual lubing part here soon. So, this is an important part. These are these little straws they put on the side of your can. You got two of them just in case. And you just plop it on. And here's the important part. Shake it up. And this is how you lube a chain. See how these little cracks right here where the o-ring is at just like that and I do every single little link for every crack that you put you're pretty much oiling the whole part of that 